Hi, this is Belly Dance with Talia, and today we're going to talk about finger symbols. They're often called zils, which is the Turkish name, or sagat, which is the Arabic name. They are worn on the middle finger and the thumb, usually between the knuckle and around the bottom of the fingernail. This one I wear on, on my actual knuckle. And when you hit them together, you're going to move just the middle finger, not the thumb, so that it strikes the thumb, and the thumb doesn't move any at all. You want to make sure that you're not cupping the zil, that it stays open, so that you get a nice ring. Now when you start to play, we play in threes. And if you're right-handed, you're going to go right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right. If you're left-handed, you'll switch this all to the left, so it'll be left, right, left. Now when we're thinking about the music, we're going to think and a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. So your downbeat is always the third stroke, which is the number. So if we play it faster, it's full time. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. Again, half time. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four. Right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right. If you have any questions, feel free to email me at taliamedance at yahoo.com. Also, don't forget to subscribe and to leave a comment.